Hi, I'm James Schellinglaw aboard Celestial Cristal in Greece, and I'm here with Gordon Durker, who's the Vice President of Sales for Celestial, and we're going to talk to you about how to sell this great product if you don't already know about it. If you don't, you got to know about it because it's really a fantastic way to see Greece. And you'll find out about all that and more on Insider Travel Report. Well, Gordon, it's great to cruise with you again. Here we are. We've been, you know, we've been cruising the past four days here in Greece. Uh, we actually have a contingent of travel agents on board, right? We do. I mean, uh, one of our strategies, I want, if you like, as we started sailing again this year, was to get as many travel agents on board to create that like Pied Piper sort of uh, opportunity. Because we want to spread the word that it's absolutely perfectly safe to come to Greece and enjoy cruising again. No, and it is, and we're, we're going to actually talk to one of them later. Uh, but, but. It's been a revel, and I've been on this product. Obviously, you have been. I've been on like this is my fourth time on this particular ship, and I really have always loved the product. It's 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 a fantastic way to see Greece. But let's talk a little bit about those travel advisors who don't know it so much about how they can sell Celestial. Yeah, one key thing to keep in mind is that we are a local company. We are Greek, and that's in our veins. So we want to sort of show off the destination. And destination is the key word. Right. I mean, people that travel with us, and I guess they're travelers first, cruisers second, um, enjoy you know, exploring and learning about history, culture, interacting. I mean, immersiveness is one of the cliche words that people right. like to right. refer to. And that's, I think, what we are all about. No, it is amazing, and you go to a different destination there, sometimes two in one day because you are exploring the Greek islands, right? Yeah, I mean, we go to the marquee famous ones. You know, you have to do Santorini, you have to do Mykonos, and, you know, those are absolutely stunning. But what about Milos or Patmos or, you know, the... Uh, we went to Rhodes the other day. That was yeah, it. Rhodes, Crete. I mean, these are islands that I think everybody should see because they're all so different culturally, historically. There's all different angles that make it so much worth your while to sail with us and explore Greece. Now, the other thing is, the bonus is, you got a pretty nice product on board. And uh, you, you, I've found, I've always said to people, the secret of Celestial is you have pretty decent entertainment, very nice entertainment every night, and the food is very good too. Yeah, I mean, you know, obviously, you're, our, our sort of objective is to get people to enjoy Greece on the ship as well as off the ship. So the entertainment will have some themed, like the first night, the entertainment was all about a Greek wedding and, and the journey that happens when you're in Greece and getting married. Um, but same with the food, you have lots of Greek food options mixed in with international because you cannot eat Greek salad every night. But uh, we're, try we're trying though, I think. Yeah, we try. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's actually very nice and it's very tasty, but we do offer options for everybody. No, it's great, and every day, and then of course, we're, when you're out in the islands, you can sample some of the local cuisine, uh, which is the idea. And and you mentioned the entertainment. Uh, you know, last night we saw this kind of circ. I won't say Cirque du Soleil, but a Cirque uh, uh, performance that was really a lot of fun. Well, actually, you gave away a little secret. The lady that actually puts together the performances used to be involved with Cirque du Soleil. So it's quite interesting that you picked up on that, actually. No, well, that's good. It was a marvelous performance. And one night we had classical. It, you know, it was just interesting. I appreciate the fact that everyone tries to do that. And you have this fabulous group of C Cuban entertainers, which you inherited from when you were cruising Cuba, right? Yeah, I mean, we love them so much and our guests love them so much. They do such a great job that we have uh, still a Cuban team of entertainers on board. And they do a fantastic job keeping us uh, you know, keep the eyes on, on, on the stage, basically, if they perform. So yeah. you can entertain yourself every night here. Uh, and then, of course, uh, I won't say, well, last night we were all watching Euro uh, soccer, and this is a sports bar, and it was packed. So, uh, uh, you know, it really was a, an event, to be honest with you. So you're not going to get that every time, but uh, it's, it's something there's a lot of socialness going around the, uh, being on this ship. Yeah, it's, it's a very international ambiance on board. I mean, a lot of our guests do come from the United States, but we have guests from Greece, we have guests from France, all over the place. And if that is something that of, is of, of interest to you when you travel, you want to meet the locals, if you like, then we're a good, good way to go. I was, I was on a, one of the cruises a few years ago, and a lot of it was Greeks on board the cruise, so it was great to be there. Now, let's get back to the how you're working with the travel advisors out there in the community. You said you're, gonna, you're doing more more familiarization trips on the, on this uh, ship and ones to come but you're also improving your technology and you're I think expanding your sales force right we are I mean the US is more and more I mean it's a key market for us it's uh, in a good season if you you know 
speak to normality, uh, sort of, it's close to 50% of our audience that we cater to. So it's, it's crucial that we provide services to the Asians that allow them to efficiently book us. So there's a new booking system coming in very shortly. Uh, online tools for agents, uh, a portal where they can actually manage their own bookings uh, without interaction with our contact center. But we're also hiring additional staff for the contact center so that we can service that business even better. Now, final question. What are the keys in your view to, again, to selling this product? Uh, you, you, also, you, you also work with top tour operators that, that in part are featuring Celestial as part of their tour programs, right? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, um, we work with the Trafalgar's of this world, the Globus's of this world, the Colette's of this world, and all of them see us as a great extension to all the travel programs that they have. And it makes sense because the Greek islands, you know, are best explored on a ship and best explored on a ship that is a Greek experience on board too. And it is more than just a ferry, believe me. It's, it's really a very comfortable place. The, the, the suites are, are wonderful. And again, give me the three keys to selling C Celestial. Keep in mind that destination for us is the hero right. and that you go to places that are off the beaten track. You're in Greece on the ship as well as off the ship and you will enjoy true Mediterranean hospitality. And that's, I think, some of the key stuff items that you need to remember when you sell and position us. Gordon, I want to thank you. It's been great sailing with you. We've had a lot of fun. Uh, we've, uh, we've ate a lot of Greek food. Uh, we, can, we don't seem to be skimping on the desserts lately because they look too good. And uh, we've had some great experiences off the ship. So again, thanks very much for hosting me on this. This Once again, it's, it's been a great experience. Thank you. And it's obviously a pleasure to have you on board again as well. And we'd love to see you next year on the experience. We're looking forward to that. We'll, we'll be on the Celestial Experience. And I'm sure you're going to do a great job as well. Again, thanks a lot. Thank you. I'm James Schellinglaw, and this is Insider Travel Report.